This video is intended for viewers 13 and up, mature collectors only. Hey guys, this is S4 4 here, back again with a new video for you guys, and today we're doing a hunting video. And uh, guess what? We have a special guest for this one. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck your grandma! <laughs> and um, if you guys don't remember, or if you do remember, this is Cannon back again. Hi! Shaw, dude! <laughs> with another uh, <laughs> hunting video and uh, she's back sooner than we thought but it's good because we all like missed her, right? Yeah, hey, what up Brownie? If you didn't miss me, don't worry, you're here for Goshen, not Cannon, Goshen. Now, let's go in. That was horrible. <laughs> We're at Quarka Comics now. It's been a while since I've been here, probably five years <laughs> or so since I've been to the shop. So let's see how Quarka's Comics is. I already see a Dragon Ball Z little logo right there. So let's check it out. I cannot see. Check it out. Marvel is sold here. No time for that. Let's go. Godzilla. Hello. <laughs> Hi, how are you? That's the most cutest thing <laughs> I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Godzilla. That's a really awesome statue up there. Oh, well that's not Godzilla. I have no idea who that is. <laughs> that's really cool. Wow, they have really cool statues. Look at the incredible, Mr. Incredible. Hey look, it's Kaka. <laughs> what are you? Oh. Wow, Should nice. It smells like an authentic a comic shop. Look at this, all Dragon Ball. Up here. Oh, because I was like, that's not Dragon Ball. That's an anime titty. Sugoi. See? All of this. Do you have all of them? I'm um, not all of them, not all of them. Yeah, I don't have every single one. I'm missing this one. Oh. And this one's really nice, like the Goku Black. Um, hey, yeah. the Philippines, right there. Oh yeah, oh. the artist who um, sculpted this figure from the Philippines, that's why it has the... Oh, yeah. that Pinoy pride. Mm. <laughs> Your mother must be sad that you are not that nurse. <laughs> don't worry, you and me are on the same boat. Some dragon stars, very, very nice. Gotta love that. Um, what else? What else? Look at these amazing statues. Not Dragon Ball, but still awesome. These are really, really, really cool. Do you like uh, comics, I Marvel? Tits, though. <laughs> oh, uh, I don't know who that is. I don't know either. Oh, Vampir Vampirilla. Vampirilla? Close enough. I don't know English. <laughs> oh, there's also, look at this. Some figures up there on display. Oh, go for it, bro. Take a look at that, wow. Gotta love those figures on display. Do you want a hot, a corn dog? <laughs> I think those are really cute. Those like food plushies, they're adorable. Take a look at those awesome figures on display. Boxes up there. Uh, so I found these two together. I have no idea why they have a correlation. Oh, really? That's <laughs> how funny. Bert and freaking Krillin. I have Krillin. That's Very cute. Good. Not every day you see Krillin little plushie. Oh, Bowser, my Any boy. more Dragon Ball plushies? Um, I found Bowser. I know he has Dragon Ball. <gasps> Look! I found Big, Big Bird. Bird. <laughs> Where were these when I was a kid? I'm sad now. I love Sesame Street when I was little. Let's see the pops. Or, yeah, okay, well, let's look a little bit more around here first. And lots of pops in the store. Lots and lots and lots of pops. Dragon Ball Pops. I want to see if there's any more, if I'm missing anything as far as Dragon Ball. There has to be more around here. 
Oh my god. Look at him. How can you resist him? Even though he's a tax fraud. <laughs> Yoshi, please pay your taxes. You're being a very bad example to the children. Gotta pay your taxes, kid. I like that. Goku Black. Yoshi, would you like some lemonade? It has eyes just for you. <laughs> How do we go from Fire Bro to Mario and then to Mario Hammer Bro? What? Very nice. Hey, got some cards over here. Can't go along with cards. Yes, you can. Ask him nice. Dr. Fatou. And all these other people who use card tricks. Okay, so now we at CD Trader. Also known as the birdhouse. There's a birdhouse next to it. I like birds. But um, yeah, in this place they have a lot of like uh, video games. They have a lot of DVDs, and music, and um, stuff like that. So their logo has freaking trunks on it, like in the same poster. So that's awesome. So let's check it out. There it is, CD Trader. Boba tea. Boba tea. I love boba tea. It's right over there. So good. She wants to go to the birdhouse. No, no, I just know mushrooms are cool to look at. There it is. Don't touch or eat unless it's served on a plate. Yeah, let's Maybe go in. It's safe. Let's go in. Wow, very nice. These are like video old. games. These are old. Operation Vietnam. I'm triggered. They got a bunch of games here too. Really? Yes. PS3. Is there anything in there? Oh, Ill. Oh, there you go. Hey, Naruto. Ultima Tenkaichi. Okay, let's see what else is here. Uh, Adventure Time? Okay. Uh, is there anything else? Mm -mm. Rayman? Alright, that's cool. They got Kingdom Hearts, something Kingdom Hearts. Uh, HD 1.5 Remix. I don't know, there's too many versions of Kingdom Hearts. The stick South Park. <laughs> yep. Naruto and Ultimate Ninja Storm. Oh, I'm gonna pop that down there. Let's see. Uh, anyway. Okay. Mm, that's nothing. What a big planet. Aw. Oh, I remember when that was a thing. A spray. I don't know what that is. We got the oh, we got the epic Madagascar car. <laughs> Let's see what, is, what else PS2. is here. PS2. Oh, yeah. PS2. We have. Oh, remember Jack and Dexter? Yeah, and they made a movie too. Did was, they? Yeah. I didn't know that. No, sorry, that was a Ratchet and Clank. Oh, that's right, yeah. Sorry. Next. You know, what else? Dead. We got Thrillville, Off the Rails. I used to play Rollercoaster Tycoon. Attack in the Power of Juju. I remember that. Yeah, me too. They also made like um, a TV show on it briefly on Oh, Netflix. they did, they did. Oh, this is Xbox 360. Yeah, Mortal Kombat. Final Fantasy. Okay, so that's it for that. How about over here? These are vintage. I like the old school. Uh, all my cousins have these. Old school is Back awesome. I used to have this um, Spider-Man game. Boys. Sonic the Hedgehog for Genesis. Rune Factory? Oh, wow. I have always wanted to play Rune Factory. I just don't have the time or money right now. Unfortunately, it doesn't show. Hey! What do you know? Nintendo and Game Boy. Oh, yeah. Who doesn't love that? Dragon Ball Z Super Warriors. Oh, I remember that Legendary Super Warriors. It was a card-based game, but I never knew how to play. But just thought it was fun to click buttons when I was little. Mario Tennis. <laughs> Star. Oh, I had Mario Tennis. Oh, oh Dragon Ball Z time. Sagas for Xbox. The worst freaking one of the worst Dragon Ball games there is. Oh really? Saga yeah. sucks so much. It was really bad. <laughs> Mario. My god, my cousin has all of these monster cards. Mickey Mouse. Hey! <laughs> oh, I think I remember some of those too when I was little. Um, I know on the PlayStation, like the OG PlayStation, there was. Um, I played this religiously. It was Goofy's Fun House. It's so sad. People don't remember Clarabelle, Horace, Clara Clark. Uh, Horace was in it too. Oh man. 
Very cool. This mystery dungeon Sega. Wow. Pretty cool. That's why I just got recognized here. <laughs> For the vintage I mean, collectors group. Life too. I know. That's so cool. I'm so angry. This, um, he recognized me from the vintage collectors group. And uh, I r helped run that group, so. It's a lot of fun. I love that group so much. <laughs> oh, we got some Dragon Ball old school DVDs. Oh, there you go. Hey, hey, hey. Cover. Bondage. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> <laughs> what does this look like to you? Bondage. <laughs> Horrible bondage. <laughs> Poor Pan. Oh. Tentacles. <laughs> what? <laughs> GT, GT. I used to have all of these. They have one super one. That's cool. You used to have all of them? What happened to them? Um, I gave some of them away and like to Goodwill. Because I didn't really need them anymore, but... Good, look at the prices here. $3 for Blu-rays. That's awesome. That's really awesome. Alright, so we got some vintage Dragon Ball games. Ultimate Battle 22. And we got Dragon Ball Legends, not the new one, but the old classic one, or the Legends, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Dragon Quest Builders. So cool, Super Batoden 2 and Super Batoden 3. Wait a minute, is that Ultraman? Oh, cool. Yes, it is. Oh my god! These are Super Famicom games. Look at like the little figures he has on his desk. That's pretty cool. I see a Goku. We gotta keep this store alive. And this, a trunk. This store's full of hope and joy and amazingness. And it's <laughs> run by a beautiful couple. <laughs> <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's my first time here and I already feel nostalgic. We gotta keep them alive. All right, guys. So now we are here at a grand opening, I guess the name is called, but- uh, We'll find out when we get in. It's you know? a brand new um, comic <gasps> shop. Brand new, brand spanking new. Yes, you're those There it is, ready to go in. It's a grand opening, I guess the name of it is called. <laughs> yep, let's go. Let's go. Oh, okay, me first. Cool, it's a lot of vintage stuff. Hello. I still have this picture frame actually. Look at these awesome like Disney I like frames. I still have this They're really cute. Look at the plushies in the back. They started selling some of the old plushies. So cool. Precious moments. My mom used to collect precious moments. My mom does too. <laughs> she used to have a huge collection. I don't know why she sold all of them. She sold them? Yeah, she sold all of the precious moments. Wow, all Disney items half off price. What is this place called anyways? I don't know. Collectibles? <laughs> I don't know. Oh. Oh, oh, got it. Here we go. Now show it to your viewers, man. Perfect. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate that. So that's it, guys. Store and name Pachuco's Collectibles Pachuco's and Closeouts. Collectibles. collectibles and Closeouts. There yeah. you go. That's but, it. But, you know, me and Ghost would like to call it the OG store. <laughs> well, this is their car in case you want to come here. Continue. Very wonderful for uh, uh, collectible fans, basically. Oh, I'm yeah. A huge, uh, huge fan of Vintage. Vintage. <laughs> Vintel. What is English? Vintel. <laughs> I'm English Ching Chang Chong. Wow, look at that Mickey Mouse candy uh, the, factory. The, these are super old, G. Like, like before my time. And wow. Probably around when my parents were just born. Really? A Chrissy fucking puzzle from the Three's Company? That's hilarious. So we got some like oh, figures my, okay, too. They're old school figures. Yeah, Star yeah. Wars. X Men. Oh my god, look at this! <laughs> what happened to him? Uh, depression. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Jim Carrey, signed by Jim Carrey. Oh, bruh. It's like all it's signatures. It's nice to know that he's recovered from a stroke. He had a stroke? Yeah. Jim Carrey? Oh my god. I didn't know he had a stroke. Yeah, he did, unfortunately. But luckily for us, he recovered. That's a good thing. That's Nobody good. wants to lose Jim Carrey yet. No, don't. Oh wow, John Lennon, Britney, Jack Nicholson, Jack Nicholson. Eight dollars? Yeah. 
Oh, these photos are reprints. In many cases, some of the these as originals would cost a hundred dollars. They are. <laughs> that is funny. I like that. That's a cool note. That is cool. At least they're honest. Yeah. True. Wow! Look at all nice. these. A lot of stuff, like old school. There might not be like Dragon Ball stuff, but there's still a lot of cool like old school stuff. Hey, that's a good thing, you know? You gotta keep it varied. And who knows, maybe some kids will be like, wow, that's interesting or fancy. Or you know? Maybe somebody will trade in the Dragon Ball stuff here and then they will have Dragon Ball stuff. Pez stuff. That's cool. so cool. Mickey plate. That looks like an 80s or 70s plate. This is around, I think, the 70s because this does... Wow, now this. Look at Yo, this. Look, I found Fred. <laughs> <laughs> but look at this Mickey. Look at this Mickey. Super duper old. Now that is old as hell. Well, that's why they don't call this place vintage for nothing. <laughs> Here, Tina. <laughs> they got comics over here. Lots of old school comics and everything. Comics, comics, comics. Lots of comics, Disney ones. Look at that. It's really cool. Someone stole her face. It's Thomas the Tank Engine. He did it. Oh my god, that doll so cool. No, 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 no. That's supposed to be Shirley Temple. Can you believe that there are some ladies' feet that went in those back in 1800s? What? Really? Those are real shoes. Oh my Whoa. god. Those are so small. That's so, that's crazy. Look. Wow. Wow. And they had to lace those things up? <laughs> that's so crazy. Bro, seriously, you gotta have midget feet for that. That's the first midget feet. Wow. That's amazing. That's, a, that's, that's so like, cool. Now that's like going back even further you ever, you ever to my hear grandma's. Of, uh, the Masons? Oh, the Freemasons, eh? Wow. Get in there and bitch. <laughs> Look at all the baseballs right here. Sign. They're just gonna freak out. They'll be like, oh, the nostalgia. All right, guys. So that was it for this video. <laughs> Sorry. Give me a minute. I just clocked out. <laughs> you know when you get out of work? Oh, I know that feeling. Enjoy that paycheck, bro. <laughs> I got it. He works right here. Where yeah, and we'll get to that store in just a second, you know? That store, very good. Very good price. Just let me know. For vintage people. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so um, then we went store. to Corka's, which had a bunch of pops, and they had Dragon Ball stuff too, some pretty good ones. And people were nice. I mean, it was like a smaller store. It was relatively small, but that doesn't mean it didn't have that many, you know, um, things you can look at and collect. A lot of uh, the basic animals and all that stuff. <laughs> right, exactly. So, but it was a good store. I haven't been there in a couple years, so it was nice to go back. And then we went to CD Trader, and they recognized me there, which is pretty cool. Um, she's famous, though. <laughs> well, he knew me from the Dragon Ball Vintage Collectors group that I got. I told you guys about that I'm an admin there, so I help run the group. And uh, yeah, he was like, "Yeah, I recognize you from there, and you like all the vintage stuff." I'm like, "Yeah, I love all the vintage well, stuff." Well, duh, she's <laughs> Goshen. How the hell do you not recognize her? I mean, unless you're not in the Dragon Ball community, then that's understandable, you know. That place was really cool because they have a bunch of video games, old school ones, new ones. They have um, Blu-rays for like what three dollars? Two dollars. Two dollars. Three dollars. Oh my god. Two dollars. That's that's so a cheap. great price. <laughs> yeah, and they had like um, a lot of. SNES games, you know. Uh, old school games. You know, it's a very wonderful store well, run by a wonderful couple, just yeah. like you know. Yeah, but they were very nice. And then we went over here to... Grand opening! I'm kidding. No, they're called... It's called Perculio's Collectibles. Perculio's? Perculio... Truly, I'm sorry, sir. Actually, one of the most interesting stores that I've, I think both of us have seen. We expected this to mainly be a hunting video for Dragon Ball Z stuff, but what we ended up finding at the end of the rainbow was a really vintage treasure. So I really um like this place too. A lot of vintage goodies. Yeah, vintage for goodies, cheap. especially if you guys want to like take a step back into several generations. You know, if you guys want to take a generation step back, you're back into the 80s. 70s, 60s. But yeah, so anyways, overall it was a great time. We saw some good stuff. Maybe not everything Dragon Ball, but still, I hope you enjoyed the stuff that wasn't Dragon Ball anyway. You know, and maybe, something you know, different. You guys could see, um, get you guys into a little bit of history. Of course, not educating you guys like school. Nah, we ain't boring people. But, you know, just in general, we just want you guys to take a little step back. You know? Yeah, and um, 
I'll put the addresses in the description so you can go to each store, whichever one you like to go and support, and tell them Goshen sent you. Goshen and Cannon sent you. Yes. So <laughs> Goshen and Cannon. Yep. <laughs> All right, guys. Anyways. Peace out until my next one. Keep breaking limits, Goshen Force. Hey, it's Pan from Dragon Ball GT, and you're watching my good friend SSJ Goshen Four. Yeah. <laughs>